toilet just flushed again. It's a ghost toilet. Ugh. <laughs> Seriously, it scares me. Okay, let's talk about characters of a story, right? <clears throat> story elements, characters. Characters is easy. It's one of the easiest ones. You guys already know this, so let's go up through it pretty quick. Okay, so we have who can be the character of a story? People. Don't laugh at my drawings. I see you laughing at a picture of my dog. <clears throat> People can be characters of a story. Diary of a Wimpy Kid. Harry Potter. Characters. Opal. Um, Opal's people. Preacher. Um, those are people. Those are characters. So we think of Wood Dixie when you think of people as characters. Um, animals. Animals can also be characters. Think about the tale of Despero. When we have Despero, Rossboro, um, Botticelli. Okay, those are animals that are characters, right? Um, creatures. Creatures can also be characters. So minions. The minions are creatures. They're characters. Um, also, I want you to, to sometimes inanimate objects can be characters if you give them human traits, right? Like um, in Beauty and the Beast, the candlestick, the clock, the pot, um, the little teacup. Those are characters in that story, right? Because they have human traits. We'll talk more about characterization later. But um, So when we're thinking about characters, we know people, animals, creatures. And then also protagonists and antagonists. We've talked about these. So you know that <clears throat> the protagonist of the story is good guy. So remember, pro. Pro is a good thing. Protagonist is the good guy of the story. Um, so... Who are we rooting for? Who is the good person or the good character of the story that we want to win, right? Um, antagonist. <clears throat> the antagonist, anti-bad. Antagonist is the bad guy or the force that is against the good guy. Because it's not necessarily a really bad, evil character. But it's whatever is working against our protagonist is going to be our antagonist, okay? So um, in, let's see. The Tale of Despero. Um, our protagonist is Despero, our main character. He's a good guy. He wants to do the right thing. And our antagonist is going to be what? Roscaro. Okay, he's our antagonist in that story. Um, he's the bad guy. He's against Despero, and he wants uh, he wants to kidnap the princess. He wants to leave her in the dungeon. And our protagonist, um, Despero, wants to save her. So our antagonist has to be Roscaro in that situation. Luckily, in the end, Roscaro turns into a pretty good dude, but for a while, he wasn't. Okay, so make sure that you remember that. Protagonist, good guy. Antagonist, bad guy, okay, or bad force. Um, if you're reading a book about uh, civil, civil rights and Martin Luther King Jr., you're going to say the protagonist is Martin Luther King Jr. The antagonist is going to be the laws um, of segregation, right, um, the Jim Crow laws and society being against um, Martin Luther King Jr. and what he wanted for African Americans. Okay, so protagonist good guy, antagonist bad guy. Characters can be people, animals, creatures. You guys already know all this stuff because you're awesome. I love you. Stay smart, stay safe, stay clean, and pray for me because this toilet keeps flushing. <laughs>